how to create a niche jewelry store on Shopify and make money online. Hey guys, welcome to this new video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create your own online store using this platform. So let's get started first by explaining the platform for you. So guys, Shopify.com is a platform where you can create your own online store in order to showcase your product to be sold to make money eventually. So let's start first by showing you how you can create your account. So here go to the search, enter Shopify, and then click on Shopify e-commerce company. And here click on the first link you will encounter. Then you will proceed to creating your account. So here just scroll down, click on start free trial, then enter your email and create your account. After that, you will proceed to this page, which will be your dashboard. So this is where you can control everything about your online store, from the orders, to products, to customers, analytics, discounts, the online store, to the settings as well, where you can control your plan, your billing, users and permissions, the payments, tax, domains, brand, store activity log, and all of those sort of things. So here in this video, I'm just going to show you how you can optimize your theme and your store in Shopify. So let's start in here. You can go with the setup guide if you want, or you can just close that. And here you will be able to manage your orders in this page. Here you can manage your products. You can add new products or delete the ones that you already have. You can also import new products from other websites as you can see you can import and here you have the customers content and those other stuff then you proceed to the online store and this is where you will be able to control your theme customize it or change it the way you want so here first click on view your store to see how is your store looking so this is how our store looking right now as you can see this is the store so let's get started by customizing it so let's scroll down to see the themes we have and let's choose a theme that will fit our niche which is the jewelry store so here as you can see we have 173 themes in the platform and we have just 12 free and 161 themes are paid so you choose the free themes in here we have 12 themes and by scrolling down you will be able to see all of them so here let's see if we have a theme that is related to jewelry or something close to that niche so here we have Pride, which is about selling, I guess, products for surfing. We have Refresh, selling products for skincare. Another one about glowing skincare. Spotlight, about fashion, clothing, about bags, origin. We have Down, it's about industrial design meets fashion, about bags. Of women, craft, taste, studio, crave, publisher, color block. Let's check down. I think this one will fit, will fit the jewelry niche. Let's view demo store to see how does how is the theme looking. So this is the theme. This is how it's looking the products I think this this theme will fit will fit our requirements so let's close this page and click on visit theme store and let's filter by price in order to choose that particular theme so let's click on free and here 
click on download the theme the name of the theme click on try theme and here we will give it a few seconds to be added to our online store themes so let's wait for it so here it's been added let's close that one so here this is the theme let's click on view your store to see how the theme is looking first we will need to add it to the store we didn't add it so here click on publish to publish the theme click on publish in here then the theme is being added let's click on view your store but it's already is this it's the same theme that we've already had so let's just start customizing it click on customize and here you will be able to change everything about your theme so first of all i'm going to explain all of those buttons in the corners so i'm going to start from the right so here you have the save button when you make any changes in the theme make sure to click on save to save those changes you have here the buttons of going back or forward if you've made a change in here and you want to go back from making that change you can do that and if you want to go forward to the change that you went back on you can do that as well and here you have the view if you want to see the theme in full screen the mobile view or if you want the desktop version and here you have the 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 inspector when this one is turned off you will be able to just click on the area that you want to change and you will be able to change it and if you have turned it off you will not be able to do that just just keep it keep it turned on it's very helpful and here in this button you will be able to choose the page that you want to change if you want to work on the home page the products page the collections the cart page the checkout you can choose the page that you want to work on and here you have the languages if you want to make it international or with your country here you have the three dots if you want to edit the code edit default theme content if you want to view the store view documentation get support and here if you want to exit and here you will be able to work on the sections here you have the theme settings where you can add your logo change the colors change to the theme that you would like the colors that you would like to work on and the other the other settings so that's it guys for today's video don't forget to like the video subscribe to my channel and share the video with your friends